So, Nadine Voss. Don't talk to me. <laughs> I was gonna say, you look good. Was I not clear? What's that smell? Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't exactly had access to running water and soap recently. God. All the people you could have brought with you. <laughs> She saved my ass more than once, you know. You do remember that uh, she also tried to kill Nathan and I many, many times. And to be fair, you two tried to do the same to her. Uh, yeah, but it, that's not the point. The point is that the second we turn our backs, there will be a knife in there. I can hear every word you're saying. I know! I trust her. <laughs> you know what? Fine. I guess I'm just a little bit irked that we are walking away with nothing. But I guess you know what that's like, right? <laughs> oh, my. Real classy, thank you. Time and place, children. More that came from. Bike racks after school. Ugh. Just hurry up. The kings have one final test. Looks like you won't be needing us, though, so we'll just be on oh, our on way. On the contrary. Surely you know the story. <laughs> you see, Shiva gave Parashuram the mighty axe that struck Ganesh in the face, bringing Shiva's son, one of the greatest of the gods, to his knees. Another casualty of war. Don't. Yeah, seriously, Chloe, he's just gonna kill me. He's right. But if you refuse, <coughs> you will watch them die, inch by inch. All right! <coughs> Chloe, don't! Sharama. Chloe, don't you give this schmuck what he wants. Quiet! Wait a minute. He's yielding. Quiet! Ganesh, quite an obstacle you've placed in my path. What are you doing? Shut up and watch. Unexpected. Holy shit, she's got balls, huh? I, I don't understand. It's an idiom. That's because you've got it all twisted, my friend. Ganesh allowed himself to be struck by the axe. That makes no sense. 
Not to a selfish prick, no. You <laughs> see, Ganesh could have defeated Parashurama easily. But if he had, that would have made Shiva's axe look weak. Powerless. Ganesh sacrificed himself to preserve his father's honor. See, even she gets it, not a drop of Indian blood in her. Magnificent, isn't it? Oh, what? Nothing to say now? Oh, if you like, I can tell you where to stick it. <laughs> well, my friends, I would love to kill you myself, but we must not anger the gods, for you have brought me a great fortune. Okay, then, what are you doing? You're going to flood the chamber. I will miss you. Come on, is this really necessary? You know, nothing is ever truly destroyed. Only purified and reborn. Just shoot us and get it over with. Right? As the water fills your lungs, you will have time to reflect on the choices that brought you here. Perhaps in your next lives, you will fare better. Prick. I don't know about you guys, but I got a lot of regrets swimming around in my head right now. Tell me about it. I was really looking forward to kicking your ass again. Hey, you know, I'm not exactly thrilled about drowning next to you, either. Could you give it a rest, guys? I'm trying to concentrate. What are you doing? A little preparation goes a long way. Ha-ha, <laughs> yes! We're smoking. <laughs> Professional courtesy. Of course. So, are we good? No. I figured. If we hurry, we can intercept them before they make the sale. Huh. And there's our ride. These are nice. There. Railroad tracks. Stop here. The uh, Sovel have lookouts throughout the area. Best door on the side of caution. Right, right, right. And then we lose the tusk. You're welcome to stay behind. I'm just saying. Right, 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 right. Less talking, more walking. So all that time in a Sov's care, and you couldn't get any intel on the bias? Uh, well, I tried. I saw the cagey one. Almost never talked shop in front of me. Can't imagine why. Hey, he trusted me enough to believe I was an expert in all this hoisala crap. Hoisala. 
Yeah, let's hope. By the way, thanks for keeping him busy for us. Yeah, you know, I wanted to buy you some time in case you were coming to get me. Of course we were. Seriously, thanks. I thought I was a goner. I wouldn't let that happen. Your brother would never let me hear the end of it. Found the train tracks. Sort of. Kind of a shock seeing all these modern structures after the Hoysala ruins. Those are the British or Portuguese. 1800s, so not quite modern. Fine. I heard you worked for us off, too. How'd, uh, how'd you deal with the torture? What, what do you mean? Did he torture you? Oh, yeah. Wouldn't stop talking about himself or his cause. It's like, I get it, man. You don't have to sell me on it. <laughs> I'm just here to make some scratch. I understand it when people pray on incessantly. Yeah, I know, right? There we go. This way. Copy that. Should have packed my machete. Uh, little help? No problem. Go ahead. No, no, you first. Much obliged. Wow. A detour? You coming? Uh, I would, but the bridge here is a little busted. So jump. <laughs> I'm flattered you think I'm capable of superhuman feats, but it's kind of far. You never know until you try. Sit tight, Sam. We'll get you across. Hey, this might do the trick. Holy mother of shit, this is heavy. Oh, damn you, we're joking. I never joke about anything. You know, one of you could have just let me borrow your robe, but... Uh, here goes nothing! close you in one piece yeah go team come on we're exposed up here you know I feel so much safer with her around Nadine see if there's something up there we can use I didn't do it no we're good come on China I'll give you a boost all right just trying to be chivalrous just watch him then Got it. The 
see anything up there we can climb on? Like a crate or something? <laughs> this should work. <laughs> huh. Nice. <coughs> Got it. Come on up. Go ahead, Sam. Age before beauty. Oh, you're too kind. No. She's just worried I'll kick it over and leave you down there. Right. Uh, how about I scout ahead of you? I wouldn't really <coughs> leave him. Yeah, well, play nicer. Sam, see your way forward? Yeah, sort of. We'll uh, definitely need your grappling hooks. Okie doke. On my way. A little precarious. Great, I'll just borrow Nadine's hook and... I have a better idea. What are you... Up? Don't move! Ow, come on, hey! I said don't move. <coughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> hey, Chloe, can I borrow your rope? Of course. Ow, me your... first, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just leave <laughs> the rope for me, please. You got it! <laughs> There's a cave up there. Might cut through for the tricks. I take it she's going first. Why don't you go ahead? Leave the rope for me. You got it. Next time, bring your own bloody rope. Heads up. Okay. <sighs> What is this place? Light? Sure. All right, well, there's only a few of them. We can probably... What? That Asaf guy doesn't do things halfway. It's going to be quite a show. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Sure? What the hell are they doing there? We got rid of all these Hey, guys. Sam. Saying. Hey. You cool? Yeah, I'm cool. Because I need you to be cool. I'm cool. All right, ladies. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to take the guy on the right. You two go ahead and Shit. just... <gasps> she said she was cool! Whoa! Following your example? Yeah, but... Come on. No way I'm letting mm. anyone from Shoreline get the task. I think we can squeeze through here. <clears throat> Give me a hand. Fraser, you go first. Thanks. Yeah. 
doing? We're nearly to the rail yard. Shouldn't be long now. Necessary. Okay. Now then. Guards, ball, she's alive. <laughs> Nadine, she's over here. Are well, you all right down there? Yeah, I was fine until Sam made me picture God's balls. Where are you? By the radio tower. Nadine, do you see way up? Fraser, we'll find something you can hook your rope to. Ah, oh, sounds like a plan. Got something for you. The bracelet against that strut. I'm doing it. There. Okay. Come on up. Well, that doesn't it's sound ugly. good. Jesus. Not quickly. Oh, shit. Well, it looks sturdy enough. Thanks, you too. Well done. Yeah, not bad. Considering it was her idea. <laughs> so, you never heard a self talk about Shoreline? Swear to God. All I heard from this man was the Indian Army had cut off his supply chain and they were looking for outside <laughs> help. The salt must be desperate. Yeah, I mean, Shoreline's willing to take money from anyone. I, I mean... Forget it. It's true. Let me a hand? Sure. way through though. No, no good. Way through here is blocked. A little high. Sam, bet you're tall enough to get that ladder. Come on, I'll boost you up. I'll give you a hand. More the merrier. Yeah, I'm 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 okay with this, sure. Ready when you are. <laughs> Have you ever lost? Oh shit! Sorry! <laughs> Great. Any spare ladders up there by any chance, Sam? I will look around. Been a crazy couple of days, hasn't it? Yeah, well. Can't say I was expecting Sam Drake to come back into my life. You know, I wasn't sure if I could trust you either. Had to test you a little bit. Hmm. That include making me wait two hours in a war zone for you? Certainly tested my patience. See, in that instance, I was just straight up late. There was this little girl in the market who sold me a scarf. She wouldn't take no for an answer. <laughs> Likely story. Hey, uh, you two head back to the tracks. I found something here that'll work. Yep, coming. <laughs> okay, Sam, what do you got? I have found a crate. Well, of course you did. Here, I'll push it down. Wait, it won't be high enough on its own. Oh, right. Good point. Uh... We'll 
bring the cart over. We'll meet you halfway. There you go. That's using the old noodle. The what? It's the... Your brain. The noodle, it's a saying, as in your brain? That is not what I pictured. There was a compliment. <laughs> Miss Ross. Don't call me back. Yeah, well, it's professional courtesy. In that case, call me ma'am. Yeah, no, I can't. I can't do that. <laughs> oh, hey, I guess I missed that. My rope. Go ahead. Uh, I'm part uh, of the rope club. Uh, it's clear. Come on. Yeah, I got your rope. Thanks. Well, this just keeps getting better and better. Between Asav's man and Shawline, there must be at least a couple dozen guys in there. Hang on. Wasn't that great? Uh, guns, ammo, maybe? Maybe. I thought Shawline didn't do arms, did We... They didn't. Never mind the crate. Where's the tusk? Well, there's a solve. With... Orca. Who? My former lieutenant. <laughs> I remember this guy. Yeah, there he is, in all of his mullet glory. Right? <laughs> she gets it. Okay, well, the deal's done. Your boy Orca has the task. Let's go relieve him of it. Hey, whoa, 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 wait. We've got a plan, guys. Like I said, there's over a couple dozen guys in there. Relax. You'll live longer. I am so proud. What just happened? Safety's off, chappies. No word to our lookout, so we're on clean up. Take extra care with this rock. Oh, great. The chopper's airborne. No. Better we'll stick around to clean house first. Clean us. Let's bring that sucker down. <laughs> Oh, no! 
to the door! Here we go! Oh, hi! Profitable, for starters. I think that was a rhetorical question, love. I should have shot you back on that godforsaken island. I wish you had. It would have spared us the sight of watching you turn tail and run. How would you just hash your shit out on your own time, okay? Uh, Tusk, please. You two. Partners. <laughs> Either you've got a piss poor memory or you're even more desperate than I thought. Jeez, I'm just getting up from all sides today, aren't I? I'm not the one reduced to hustling weapons to ragtag insurgents. Ah, there it is, eh? There it is. Always thinking too small. You really think I would have traded this in exchange for munitions? I don't give a shit. Hand over the tusk. A horse belt. You're gonna miss the fireworks, man. I won't ask twice. Cat. Gun! Nice shot. Thanks. Pattern's a little wide. You Get could... the hell off me. Yep. Yeah. All right. Hi, a third of that is mine as well. You're splitting, Cloetia. Okay. I know you're new to this, but that's not exactly how it works. Consider it a service charge. Hang on a goddamn second. It's a bomb. What? A salve traded the tusk for a bomb. Fireworks. Th th this, this is big. Yeah. Those tracks run right through the city. Through the market. So we'll find the nearest town. Notify the authorities. It'll be too late. If that goes off, it'll kill thousands. And that is a terrible shame. But we did get what we came for. I'm... <sighs> what? You are not seriously going after that train. Okay, fine. Fine, you have a plan? Doesn't seem to be much of a requirement in this organization. Are you really going to let her do this? No, I'm... I mean, she's got a valid point. Shit, I don't know, okay? This is not our fight. You said so yourself. Even if you catch that train, what happens? Disarming the bomb is impossible. You're right. Good. Good, so... We'll... We'll call the authorities this and... This isn't our fight. It's my fight. That bomb detonates in the city. It'll spark civil war. I can't walk away. I'm tired of walking away. You'll die. I can live with that. Hey! <clears throat> Save my share of the task, okay? Just in case, right?
Well, you're not gonna leave me back there with her. Out. No. I call shotgun. <laughs> Fine. I'll sit in the back.